Hey, hey, hey. Good morning. Hope you guys enjoyed that quote that I put there. I think that's what I'll start doing is I'll put some kind of a motivational or just kind of a feel-good quote or something at the beginning of all my videos. Start it off right. Only seems fitting. Got a busy day today. Thought I'd take you guys along. So, let's get going. So right now, I'm on my way to the bowling alley. It's a pre-bowl for my league. I got some stuff going on tomorrow when the league is supposed to be happening. So I'm going to go pre-bowl and get my scores set for tomorrow night. strikes right here. 195 is what I'll score. Three games, 184, 201, 190, 575 series. Not bad. I'm happy. I'm not professional at all. So the first thing about getting to know me, god damn, it's hot. I enjoy bowling. I've bowled on a league for two years, and then just kind of by myself or with friends and families seriously for probably four years or so I don't expect to turn pro or do anything special but it's just fun you know league nights you just get out have a good time meet new people take out your aggression on the pins but one of my goals in life at some point you know I really 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 want to bowl a 300 game, a perfect game. It's one of my goals. So what I think I'll do at some point, hopefully, is I will, I don't know if I'd be able to do it. What I really want to do is, I'd really love, 
Safety first. I'd love to go bowling and bowl three games every single day until I get a 300, at least for a year. So 365 days, three games a day, just to challenge myself to see if I could bowl 300. That could be fun. Another thing that I really want, so I guess this leads into the next part of what I'm into, golfing. Bowling and golfing, I mean, a lot of people say they go together, which doesn't make sense to me. But golfing, I love to golf. Nah, again, not serious. I don't expect to do anything special with it. But the other thing that I want in my life is to hit a hole in one at some point in my life. The question is, what's just going to come first, the 300 or the hole in one? I guess we'll find out at some point. I may, I may go my whole life without ever bowling a 300 or hitting a hole in one. Anyway, enough with my rant. I think I'm going to go get some food. I'm starving. I haven't eaten all day. I mean, I got up at 7. It's now almost 11, so I mean, it's not been that bad. But yeah, uh, let's go get some food. Got to hit the store. And then we'll be going home to do some around the house projects. Thirsty ho. All right, so I already went home, already ate some food. I ended up taking about a three hour nap. And then I was given the chore of going to the store, buying fertilizer, and laying down step one. You know, I don't mind taking care of the lawn, but here's my problem, okay? I'm not short. I am a really tall guy. I am six foot seven. Our fertilizer layer thingy is not built for tall people. I understand that like 30 years ago people were a lot shorter than they are today. But come on. Grow with the times, people. People are starting to be taller than they ever were. Build shit taller than they ever were. It's frustrating. You'll understand when you see this. Hi, Chance. And Razor. I've got three dogs. Chance and Razor. And then Phoenix is over there. I know. I know. Hi, hi Pops. Alright. So I have to kind of shush. I see you. I'm right here. I kind of have a chance. Go lay down. Anyway, I kind of have to slouch to lay this fertilizer. My overall point is. Yeah, I probably should just go buy a different fertilizer layer, but come on, man. Build things to like normal people size. And here's the thing, like it's already adjusted to its longest, to its longest length. So it's like, even if I were to, oh yeah, hey, let's adjust it. Nope, can't do that. You know why? Cause screw tall people, right? Right.